Welcome back, this is Baller Scoopal with more Let's Play on the Rain Slick Precipice of Darkness, Episode 2. I'm joined, as always, by the wielder of hoes, Adria. When we last left off, we failed at the robot monkey fighting. But we have other things that we can do, so we're going to head back to the map and try to take care of a couple other things. The Riverbrook Park Estates sounds like a plan right now. The Riverbrook Park Estates are the seat of New Arcadia's wealth and power. If not its morality. Well, seems like I've crossed train tracks somewhere around here. But there is stuff that I can do over here. I can only open in insane mode. I did get a request to do insane mode, or at least some things about insane mode. I'll see what I can do. The rat eyes you suspiciously. The nearby chest may be its home. We'll see what I can do about opening that some other time then. I might show off a few things that are different. We will see how things end up going for me this run. The disintegrating odor is held together by ads and sheer habit. This is living, boys. Yes, getting drunk all the time. What else could you possibly ask for? Our, wait, what did you say? We should release the hounds, okay. Our public gardens are the envy of New Arcadia, along with our flying steak machines? Steak machines. People keep stealing our flowers. We should release the hounds. Odds and ends for the discerning hobo. Here's somebody I need to talk to. Curtis, is that you? The shock is evident and tectonic. He works to regain his composure. So, uh, how are you, Curtis? How's tricks? If he recognizes you from before, he doesn't reveal it. I am Curtis Swindle, reputable vendor. I sense a hunger in you, a hunger for bargains. As a purveyor of unbelievable yet wholly legitimate merchandise, I am in a position to satisfy you in absolute terms. Looking for a place to live. Have you heard of any vacancies? Yes, friends, yes! There is a vacancy in your life that only these amazing projects, products can fill. His arm sweeps over his wares gracefully like some magician's assistant. Huh. He continues to hold the pose. What are you selling? Let's see what you've got. Curtis Wendell takes a moment to arrange everything just so. Yes, as you see, I really brought the world to New Arcadia. This beautiful diamond ring I just obtained. This golden bracelet from the same vendor. And this broken piece of valuable antique. Oh, I think I recognize that. That's a phonograph? That's what we're going to go for? How much for the diamond ring? It's a lot, right? Ten million dollars. I have zero million dollars. That price does include tax. Oh, thank goodness. How much for the bracelet? I kind of have my eye on it. A million dollars, but remember that much of it goes to charity. I still have no money. Oh, which one? The uh, Curtis Swindell Foundation for the Betterment of Curtis Swindell. I see. How much for the photograph? I have a feeling this is going to be the only thing I can get. Keep it in mind that it's very old and top of it and top of it is broken completely off. Seventy million dollars! This sad hunk of a phonograph reeks of whiskey, sex, and regret. Don't we all? All right, I guess I'll see you later. Do not tarry long. Bargains of this magnitude cannot endure. Sure they can't. I'm feeling that none of those will be moved at all. What can I do with the flower? <laughs> I got a daisy. It's a gift for Pearl. Simple yet elegant, but mostly simple. All right, that sounds like a plan. We also have irises, multiple ones of those. Also called frost flowers. Irises are pretty badass as far as pre pretty plants go. I'm sure they are. What the hell's that? Something to destroy. Okay. Uh, maxed out on ouchies. Maxed out on liquid armor as well. Any of these things? None of them are things. But we get into a fight. That's not what I anticipated. Really? Nine oh, one. Oh, oh, oh. Darling, let them die, please. Yes, dear. Uh-oh. 
Things are not looking good. All right, let's go for the basic attack on you. You're the weaker one. You are weak versus punches, but uh, didn't work out so well. Let's just try to focus on this guy. I misclicked a little bit there. Heavy shot. Did he defend her? Is that what this is? Oh, she's a healer. That that was a lot slower of a throw than I thought it would be. All right, punch him. Oh, 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 oh. She, they keep moving around on me. That was nowhere near her. Nowhere near her. Now I'm making this all way too complicated than it needs to be because I cannot, I cannot get them to focus the way that I want. All right, I do need to finish him off with. Don't you waggle your finger at me. Oh, oh, and a counter attack. Nice. Oh. Ow. Oh. She blocked it? How dare she? No, not. <laughs> Don't you dare finish him off with this. Oh. Oh. I hate you so much right now. Oh. All right, we will go for this then. Weak to punches. Apparently, rich people are weak to punches. Who would have guessed? Good God, that is a lot of damage. All right, smack her again. Go for this. Oh. I don't know how to work this one. Oh, right, it's the same one. Except it's a little faster. Which is good, actually. And we get the kill. I don't know what I was looking at there, but uh, she had four sets of ribs. Adria is the only one that needs more overkills at this point. What the hell is that? Do I really have to click on it in order to see it? Where's my inventory? What is this? This is chocolate. These are legendary Dodecadence brand. I will never get that the first try. Dodecadence brand chocolate polyhedrons found from annoying couples. Yes, they are. Crushed chocolate. Whoops, you smashed it. I guess you killed them too hard. Collected from annoying couples. We have, I think that's it. All the rest of the stuff we've seen. Whoa, what's this? Oh, the golden hair. Right. We had that. And we used these, including the engine. All right. We're ready to hopefully move on a little bit. I did not anticipate getting into a fight right there. I guess I'll accept that, though. What are you going to do? That needs to be destroyed. Yes, the golden trash can mailbox had nothing in it. I don't really see all that much going on around here. There aren't even too many rich people for me to kill. Oh, I see you. I'm probably going to need to get something out of that for you. All right. Roses. Gift for Pearl. Man, these fuckers are everywhere. What do we have here? Headline. Eggplant Lincoln rises from grave. I knew it. What the hell? These, this hydrant actually refreshes fires with cool spring water. Cherry red automobulato imported. Of course it is. All right. I assume that there's going to be some uh, robots in here. Indeed there are. <laughs> Oh, fuck. A winner is me. 120 more parts coming my way. I should probably use items more often in battle is what that's telling me. I got a couple levels up and a new attack for Gabriel. Vulgar arc. Press the A and D keys as they pass into the target zone to inflict more damage. This one's more difficult, but it does more damage and has a chance to stun. Actually, that one is a little difficult for me and I'm never sure I'm going to get it right every time. But we'll see what I can do this next one. All right. Dahlia, let us run away. I, I don't think she's into it. Now put on the leash like a good boy. Yeah, that's also a thing. Looks like I got another new item. What is this? That... Why don't they just show it to me? I really gotta look for it every time. What is... Oh. Soothe X Ultra. We've had that one before. That's probably why they didn't show it to me. All right, we are... Good to go. 
I had to move over a little bit when I killed him. He ran away, but uh, nothing particularly exciting happened. Other than that, he ran away and healed himself. It was a little weird. But we can destroy that. I really do need to use more items, don't I? I don't need to, though. I get a heal after every fight, so... Have not been needing to use the items inside of battle. The Museum of Things. I can't go into the Museum of Things? Is it closed? <laughs> Plant Lincoln asks, why? Why? Oh, don't miss that. It's right there. So small. Easy to miss. Helium gas. That is probably going to be very useful at some point. All right. Now put on the leash like a good boy. More couples to take out. More dynamite is always useful. And I have maxed out Adria's overkill. So we are good to go there. You're new. How you doing, buddy? No, you just ran along the path with me. You are not new at all. Just met you at the, uh, the entrance. So he's just following me around, apparently. I'm sure I like the sound of that. What the hell is a Gilderoy? Already full. Wait, no, I need this. Daisies! Simple yet elegant, but mostly simple. Yes, we already picked up daisies. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure what to make of that, but uh, the machine just turns everything to gold, apparently. Gabriel approaches the machine, his face distorted by the curve of the tank. How do we get this fucker home? Uh, whoa. I don't know what I want. There's ever so much to see. Uh, examine the gliding bell? The gilding bell, sorry. It is said that Josiah Gilderoy truly hated dogs. You think there might be some truth to that. All right, inspect the tiny door. The Gilderoy's thick, largely soundproof bell is a convincing argument for the existence of hell. It's not a literal hell for dogs, then almost certainly a place of damnation for the machine's twisted creator. Take a moment to consider the device. This mockery of a dog's domicile hurls ribbons of amber light into the sun projects an air of unmitigated canine ecstasy. Frisbees slicing the summer breeze, redolent with honeysuckle and sweet clover. It is rather more silent on the topic of boiling gold. Yeah. You turn your attentions to matters slightly less, or sorry, you turn your, wow, I cannot read today. You turn your attention to slightly less horrifying matters. I, uh, I, I don't know what to do, so I'm going to leave it alone. I think we're done coating things with gold, at least for now. Gabriel attempts to conceal his disappointment. Yeah, I'm not sure if uh, turning the flowers into gold is going to be a, a good thing, so I'm going to hold off on that for the time being. Compound Interest Boulevard. People keep stealing our flowers. We should release the hounds. I've been told that, but I'm going to keep taking your flowers. These are among the most luxuriant hydrants in the world. Reading. It's a thing. All right, so I still need to find out what to do with the flowers. Military mobilized to stop Eggplant Lincoln. Ironically, you aren't dressed well enough to enter the shop of splendid formal wear. They will not sell me formal wear unless I'm already in formal wear. What if it's my first formal wear? There's so much money in there. It's so much that I don't have a use for right now. That one's empty, too. There's concept art number seven. I don't know how many I have. I don't think I have seven, though. Can I do anything with any of the coins? Can I pick up the coins? This would help me get a place. I am in search of a house still. Yeah, you guys all say the same things. Still full there. But I do need to get into a fight. Uh, oh, I need to kill you, too. Oh, double couple! A couple more levels, a couple more 
Chocolate, I guess. One's kind of crushed already, though. I still feel like I should be able to get that stuff. This roadster features narrow tires for easy maiming. Yes. That's definitely the thing I want. Man, I am not getting any more items. Like, almost to the point where I don't even want to look anymore. But I'm going to keep looking. Like I said, almost. Small diamonds spell out the words fire hydrant. <laughs> Just a little over the top. The sedan costs more than, than most people spend on oxygen in a year. And I spend a lot on oxygen, apparently. Keep off the grass. The sign's tone seems unnecessary. Just says keep off grass. I don't know. I don't see the joke there, but whatever. Eggplant Lincoln reaches power level 10,000. 10,000? He just skipped the whole joke entirely. More Eggplant Lincoln here. Eggplant Lincoln Rampage stopped by a child's love. Oh, we've turned it into a movie. What is this? They've got one of these, huh? I guess they would. What is it? They're like little mechanical banks. Is it, you mean like an ATM? You move in to inspect the equipment. I have a feeling it's not like an ATM. Gaze into its advanced display. Take a closer look at the display. It shows a simple two-frame animation of a rich person beating someone to death with a gold bar. Examine the slots. You take a closer look at the slots on the machine. One slot has an image of a card being inserted. The other has an image of money being dispensed. Gabriel taps it with his index finger. I think this one's my favorite. Run your fingers along the keypad. The pad is a cluster of numbered buttons, starving for input. Fine chocolates and bits of steak are caked in between the keys. All right, I guess we can't do anything with it, so we'll back off a little. You give the machine some space. I, yeah, I can't do anything with it. We step away to the sound of clinking coins. Hey, on here, a sign on the perpetually closed door says, please make use of our portable banks. For when you want to do your banking on the go. Uh-oh. The gate is locked, presumably to keep people like you out. That's probably true. But we have things to destroy that will probably give me something that I'm already maxed out on. I don't need it. I just don't. More irises. Anything else? Another couple. Looks like we have almost reached the end. We still got a ways to go, looks like. 